with his defeat of the stronger ninja, Kabuto, Naruto Uzumaki had clearly shown progress far beyond what anyone expected. But this only made Sasuke drive himself harder. While once there had been a world of difference between the two, Naruto had matured quickly. He had begun to catch up to Sasuke. Sasuke, meanwhile, grew impatient for his own growth. He wondered if he'd ever gain the strength to defeat Itachi. Revenge against his brother. The bond with his friends. These were the choices he placed upon the scales. In the end, Sasuke Uchiha chose revenge. In order to gain power, he set off to join Orochimaru. Even if the road led into darkness, it was the path which Sasuke had chosen. Why? Why are you leaving without a word to anybody? Why are you isolating yourself like this? I'll never be like you or Naruto. Sasuke... I'm so in love with you, I can't even stand it! I'll even help you get your revenge. Just stay here. Stay with me. You haven't changed. You're still annoying. Don't leave me. One more step and I'll scream! Sakura, thank you. Sasuke. One who would attempt to stop him. It was Sasuke's closest friend, Naruto Uzumaki. Desperately, Naruto followed. But along the way, he was met by a ninja dispatched from the hidden sound. The ninja, Kimimaro, had been sent by Orochimaru to stop Naruto. Impatience, anger, a storm of feelings raged in Naruto's breast. I won't allow you to reach Sasuke Uchiha. He is to be the vessel of Lord Orochimaru. Get out of my way! Finish you off quickly. All right, let's run wild. Let's fight. Over there. Got it.
Naruto left Kimimaro behind and continued on. Until at last, the sound of echoing thunder meant that he'd arrived at the ravine known as the Final Valley. There, with his back to him, stood his rival and closest friend, Sasuke. Obsessed with his thirst for power, the Sasuke he had once known seemed lost forever. Naruto called upon their bond. But Sasuke had severed the bond from his heart, and Naruto's words fell on deaf ears. It was already too late. It was too late for words. But even if it took brute force, Naruto Uzumaki would bring him home. He clenched his fists. Naruto challenged Sasuke. I'm going to Orochimaru. He wants you for a host body! You think I'm just gonna let you go? Doesn't matter. As long as I achieve my goal, that's enough. You can't do this! I'll take you back by force if I have to! Overlapping feelings! Friends duel, staking their bond to each other! <sighs> you know what they say, don't you, Naruto? When two shinobi are powerful enough, they can read each other's thoughts simply through an exchange of fists. <laughs> You've always been naive, Naruto. So tell me, do you know my thoughts? Can you tell what's on my mind? Taking it now. You're dead serious about this, aren't you? You really mean to kill me. Don't you, Sasuke? But still, I don't know why. I don't know why, but 
I can't bear you being taken by someone like Orochimaru! <laughs> I'll just wait for him to surface, and then finish him once and for all. What? Is... Is that Naruto? What's this fear I'm feeling? Let's wrap this up, not at all. Let's fight! Just end it. This battle. And all the battles until now!
was too late. I'm sorry I didn't make it in time. Naruto. Knowing you, you must have put up quite a fight. Sasuke. It's time to end this. This battle. <clears throat> and all the battles we've had until now. Chidori! Sasuke. What's happening? P Pervy Sage? Hey there. As usual, your wounds seem to be healing quickly. Huh? Oh. Yeah. It seems that Sasuke was a hopeless case. Training? That's right. You are now officially my apprentice. Within three years, I'll make you a full-fledged ninja. Huh? Then I can go after Sasuke again! But listen. Huh? Forget about Sasuke. He's gone. Sasuke went to Orochimaru of his own free will. No matter what you do, you will not change. But Sasuke is... Trust me, you should just forget about bringing him back. It's the tragic path of self-righteous fools. He may mean nothing to you, pervy sage, but Sasuke is my friend! Can you honestly call him a friend? Just look at what he's done to you. It's... He was destined to leave sooner or later. Don't blame yourself. Dismiss him from your mind and move on. To be a ninja, you need more than strength and jutsu. You must acquire the judgment to make the right decisions. If you want to live as a ninja, you must become smarter. This world is no place for a fool. That's the reality. I understand. Being smarter means what you say it does. I'll remain a fool my entire life. I'll create some incredible jutsu. And I'll rescue Sasuke no matter what! If you try this on your own, the only jutsu you'll come up with is some terribly smutty thing, no doubt. But... This is so colossally foolish that it might even work. We have a lot of work to do when you get out, so be ready, you incredible fool you. All right, then. Okay! There 
you are! Pervy Sage, when are we gonna start training? Hang on a second. Just let me finish this paragraph. What are you writing? Oh, well, uh, I'm writing about my life. It's called The Tale of Jiraiya the Gallant. Your life? The meetings, farewells, and various other happenings. I'm bringing them together in ink, along with what I've learned and which paths I've taken. Hmm. This will be the ultimate novel. I'm pouring my soul into it. So? And you're still not finished? When I'm finished writing this, everything will be finished. When I find someone to inherit my will, and I feel I've properly passed it on... Well, <laughs> I guess I'm not even close to finishing it. Uh, all this inherit your will talk? It's just making me confused. One to inherit my will. Perhaps that would be... Huh? What? <laughs> At any rate, I suppose that's enough writing for now. Next up... <laughs> Time to start training, huh? Time to get to the mixed bathing hot spring to find some material for the next installment of my makeout series. Uh, I thought you'd say training! You're still hung up on this mushy makeout material! Watch your tongue, boy! This sacred writing is nothing to make light of! How about some training already? Enough! I'm in charge, and I will spar with you some other time! That's what you said last time, and the time before that! So long, sir. I see. Sounds like it may be a long trip. Yep. Time to get going, Naruto. Right! New light of history. Departure of leaves dancing in the wind. I have to go, Aruka Sensei. Next time I'll spring for the ramen. Oh boy. Do your best, Naruto. What are you doing? Hurry up! Coming! We won't be back for a while, you know. Yep. Let's go, Pervy Sage. If I get hung up on the past, I'll never get anywhere. Best to look straight ahead and keep moving forward. Hmm. to pay attention to the details, kid! I only forgot because you rushed me, Burby Sage! Oh, that's nice. Blame your teacher, why don't you? 